Hi, my name is Paul Di Benedetto. I'm the president of the Bayside Historic Society, and I welcome you all to the uh, Bayside Historic Society's uh, From the Archives exhibit on the Bayside Yacht Club. Uh, we had an idea a few years back to uh, start to bring, we have an extensive archive here at the castle at Fort Tottenham, and we decided we, you know, we need to bring up these, these items in the, in, the, uh, in the archive and make them available to the public so the public can see how Bayside lived uh, throughout its history. So here at Bayside Yacht Club, which existed from 1902 to 1993, so 90 years in Bayside, it was a very, very important um, cultural, social, and sailing hub um, for Bayside. And um, if you come here to the exhibit, you can take a look on along the walls and talk to folks who are here enjoying it. And uh, we hope you come. Okay, so um, let's show you a few things we have here in the exhibit. So this is called the Calvary Wheel. It was um, was on this it was on a boat called the Black Hawk. It was built in 1847. It was donated to the Bayside Yacht Club many years ago. And if you come here to the exhibit, you can take a look at it. It's uh, nearly 200 years old. This is a look at the Bayside Yacht Club pool. It's from 1967. Uh, the Bayside Yacht Club was a huge uh, social, cultural, and sailing hub. Um, had a lot, lot to do with Bayside life back in the day. And for 90 years, uh, people enjoyed it. It still exists in of sorts. It's not really the Yacht Club anymore. Now it's the Bayside Marina, but it's uh, still a very important part of Bayside maritime life. If you look up here, you can see here's the Cross Island, and this is this is where the club was. And uh, this is, I believe, this is the end of 28th Avenue. Yes, 28th Avenue. And uh, yeah, you walk out, and you can see where the marina was. This is circa 1930, so it changed quite a bit. And this is the first, the first clubhouse from 1915. So it changed over the years. I believe this one burned down, um, but it would adapt also to, to the club. Oh, here's a picture of it when, when after the fire. We lost a lot of great buildings in Bayside over time due to the fire. And this is actually when it opened in 1904. And uh, the first Commodore of the Bayside Yacht Club, his name was Commodore G. Waldo Smith. This was his ship. Pretty amazing. Please go to our website, baysidehistorical.org, where you can find out um, where we're located in Fort Totten and when the exhibit is open for your viewing. Thank you.